value is that? Like in a particular setting, in a particular time and place. Okay. Now the, va okay. the values change. Assu assu right. But let's go back. Assuming that you've got, assuming that you've got a good grasp of the stakeholders in a particular setting. Okay. Okay. Um, you're asking. Dep depending on the needs of the healthcare environment. Um, but I'm assuming that you've got a particular setting and a time and place, right? Okay. So when we're talking about healthcare environment, we're not really talking about a healthcare environment. We're talking about Henry Ford Hospital in Detroit, Michigan, 2008. Okay. Right? Okay. Okay. And we've got a select group of patients. I'm not, well, I don't want to muddy the issue here, but I'm not completely sure where your patients would fit in when, in your internal external rubric you know where whether they're internal to the organization or external to the organization but that aside okay. if you're administering this survey to a stakeholder groups okay. um, you're going to get some responses back to them on, on a, I'm assuming you're asking them questions like um, you know what's important to you you know asking them about needs that they might have that are particular to each stakeholder group, yes? Okay. And then out of that, then you're going to determine a set of values that are important to that stakeholder group, yes? No. No. The values, we are assessing the values of the key stakeholders in terms of the unmet performance needs. So we're not but, but, looking but at the survey's needs. gonna tell you what their, what their needs are and what their needs are that are not being met, is that correct? No, I am using the like there there is a method like uh, this, there's a outlined organizational goals in the literature which I'm using as a met performance needs. Okay, so I'm not really assessing the needs of the hospital of the of the client in this case. No, I know that. But I mean, 